Hey, welcome back to YT Finance, and today we are talking about bio-nanogenomic stock, how BNGO stock has game-changing technology. We will also look at a tweet from ARK Invest wanting to talk with the CEO of bio-nanogenomics, along with what BNGO stock price target and price prediction will be, what BNGO's financials are looking like, what competition BNGO stock has, and lastly, what analysts think of BNGO stock concerning their future earnings, revenue, and stock price. Like this video right now for BNGO stock. Subscribe if you are new, if you are already subscribed. Thank you so much. You're the best. Comment down below what you think of BNGO stock, and let's make you some free money with Weeble. Weeble is a brokerage where you can buy and sell stocks, options, and cryptocurrencies easily. Right now, if you make an account with Weeble, they will give you two free stocks, each worth anywhere from $2 to 250 $50. And if you invest $100 or more on your first deposit, you will get two more free stocks, each valued from $8 to $1,600. You are basically guaranteed to make $20 or more if you cash out immediately, or you could luck out and receive up to $3,200. Not to mention that you also have a 1 in 100 chance of getting stocks like Facebook, Starbucks, or Snapchat, and you have a 1 in 50 chance of getting stocks like Google, Procter & Gamble, or Heinz. To get this amazing offer, just press on the link in my description box down below, but do it quickly because this offer ends on January 15th. And without further ado, let's talk about BNGO stock. Here is a tweet that is congratulating the CEO of BioNanogenomics, but under that tweet, a representative from Kathy Wood's ARK Invest says that he would love to speak with the CEO of BioNanogenomics because he has questions that the CEO can answer. ARK currently owns many biotechnology stocks, so this means that BNGO stock could be the next stock to be added to one of ARK Invest's ETFs very soon. But we will talk more about ARK later in the video. Right now, bio-nanogenomic stock has major momentum behind it from investors to where the stock price has rallied a whole 328%. Even today, the stock has rallied 43%, and a reason for this rally is because BNGO released their genome mapping platform named Sapphire, which is now accredited by the U.S. College of American Pathologists. BioNanogenomics is the first company in the world to offer a lab test that analyzes the entire genome the way that Sapphire does, to the point where Jason McCarthy, who is a five-star stock analyst, says that BNGO O stock has game-changing technology. Just listen to what this analyst has to say, and I quote, Digital cytogenetics is one of the areas where Sapphire has the potential to change the clinical diagnostic landscape. The five-star analyst continues saying, Current methods are labor and time intensive, and therefore costly. Sapphire offers a more efficient and streamlined alternative, as well as potentially improved diagnostic yield. As more LTDs are developed, we anticipate the adoption of Sapphire should increase, driving revenue for BioNano. However, in Europe, they have technology that can do what BNGO Sapphire can do. But thanks to a recent publication, which we will look at next, it shows how Sapphire is extraordinary, even compared to competitors. Therefore, investors can rest assured that BioNanogenomics is top dog here, to where even the five-star analyst has a buy rating for BNGO stock at current prices. So before we go to the recent publication of the Sapphire technology, let's look at the future price targets and stock price predictions for BNGO stock. Out of three analysts, two analysts say to buy the stock right now. One says to hold the stock, while none of them say to sell the stock. The average high 12-month price target for BNGO stock was $2, but currently the stock resides at $3. However, some estimates show that BNGO stock could be worth $12 to $25 in 5 to 10 years from now. However, most of these are unfounded projections. According to the publication of a study by the Human Genome Structural Variation Consortium, the old PacBio Hi-Fi method detects 72% of structural variations in the genome. When BioNanogenomics OGM Sapphire system detects 98% of genome variations, in up to 32 different human genomes. The 
old system costs somewhere between $10,000 and $20,000 per genome, while BioNano's OGM with Sapphire system can lower this cost to only $500 per genome, which is a massive savings while also being more accurate in identifying things like autism, leukemia, and genetic disorders. The old methods and systems focused their analysis on insertions and deletions when studies clearly showed that OGM methods outperform other sequencing detection measures like looking for insertions and deletions, especially regarding cancer. After the publication, the CEO of BioNano Genomics had to say this, and I quote, This publication outlines one of the most comprehensive side-by-side -side comparisons of PacBio sequencing and BioNano's OGM for large structural variance detection. The unparalleled performance of Sapphire is remarkable because the BioNano data was generated on our commercially available Sapphire system and analyzed using its automated pipeline for a variable cost per genome of less than $500. With the latest update to Sapphire software released this week, the instrument can now generate clinical quality structural variance calls on 12 samples per day per instrument and up to 96 samples per week. The CEO basically goes on to say that Sapphire will remain the only effective and affordable technology that is capable of this type of analysis for detecting diseases in human genomes. But what about BioNanogenomics financials? Well, let's take a quick look. In quarter three, BNGO posted $2.2 million in revenue, with their earnings increasing 37%, but still negative, along with an overall loss of $10.23 million. BioNanogenomics has an ROCE of negative 0.7%, but we want this to be as positive as possible because it measures the annual pre-tax profit compared to capital employed. But honestly, it's not that bad. Plus, the ROCE is not a predictive tool. It only shows us stats based upon past performance, but we can use this to compare them with other competitors. However, even if we take ROCE, revenue, and earnings into account, analysts are still very bullish on this stock to where three out of four Wall Street analysts say to buy BNGO stock and one says to hold for the future because right now it is considered a speculative investment. This also does not take into consideration the plethora of institutional investors which ARK is likely to join by putting BNGO stock into their ARKG or ARKG ETF which has other stocks in it very similar to BioNanogenomics. Currently, BioNanogenomics has over 28 institutional investors, which hold 5.64% of the overall stocks, which leaves 153.19 million stocks still available. For example, huge companies like Vanguard Group have 5.57 million shares, which was valued at $3.26 million, but based upon current prices would now be worth around $12 million. BNGO's December forecast is that the company is anticipated to earn negative 35 cents per share, which would actually be positive news because that would represent an 81% increase from their last earnings. And because of this, along with other factors, analysts have continued to raise their price target for BNGO stock. For example, Oppenheimer and Zach's rank have increased their price targets for BNGO stock substantially. Just listen to this, and I quote, we expect growth in the cytogenetics consumable revenue in the U.S. to accelerate in quarter 4 2020 following publication in medical journals, which we already looked at, of importance, validating findings from cytogenetics analysis from various hematologic malignancies. We have now seen this quote, which was from 2020, come through to fruition because the medical journal has already been published and the sapphire technology that bionanogenomics has is absolutely astounding and incredible. Now, this technology, company, and stock is very complicated, so please do your own research as well. I personally do not own this stock yet because I am a safe investor and this is speculative to me. All articles are linked in my description box down below if you want to read these articles for yourself. Remember to get the free money that is also linked in my description box down below, and I will see all of you in the next YT video.